All right, we're just a little past 2100. This cool little trail opened up. Digging the forest. Pretty cool pine forest. A little access road. But we're gonna try to get over all the mountains today. Over to White Cap, get set up, and go from there. Yeah, we're gonna go over here to Gorman Lodge, um, to the main lodge. They got food and sauna, all kinds of stuff. How cool is that? Kind of trail. All right, so we're here. There's a big lake. They got boats and kayaks and paddle boards, and then they got that hexagonal yurt-looking thing and a bunch of other cabins and bunks, and then a nice lodge with uh, all kinds of stuff, including that power. Yes, power. But as you can see. Has information just like any of the huts. Ooh, motor, motor booty. Uh, a sauna, but it's closed right now. And bathrooms. And ooh, an old door. Pretty door. Base of plants. Snakes of Maine. Racer. Timber rattler. Water snake. Ring neck. Brown milk. Garter, red belly, eastern ribbon, smooth green, turtles, soup. Okay, I'll let you guys read those. Mm -hmm. And it's AMC. Lost and found, hiker box. motorcycle helmet. Uh, a little bit of gear type stuff, and so to speak. And I got a kitchen. Look at this old map. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'll try to get an angle, but this is like old Katahdin trail map. kind of take you through it hopefully with the, you can see through the glare a little bit oh elegant blueberries more blueberries here's Joe Mary Lakes I'm getting close to that and Potter's Cat Crazy Horse Trail hopefully you guys can see that Pollywog Pond Rainbow Lake, I'm gonna stay near there. Miss McDonald's Camp, McDougal's Camp, more blueberries, West Branch, Toll Dam, York's Camp, Boulders, Hamlin Peak, South Peak, Chimney Peak, Basin Pond Camp, Wendy Pitch, Sandy Stream, Coat something road, Tongue Pond Camp, Moonlight. There's Tongue Ponds, and then Melon Knock. That would be the end. So they're starting in Brownville. You take the old Ki River, you can go by Ward Mountain, or you can go up Lumber Camp. Oh, wait, this just comes out uh, the Hermitage and York's Camp, Long Pond. That's probably the AT right now. Be pond. So anyway, nice little stained glass, but here's like the dining area. It's pretty big. There's another little cabin for rent. And one past that, and another past that, and then 
the little yurt, which is the oldest one here. They were saying, I think, like 1800s. And a lounging area. Supposedly downstairs, they got a game room and lounge. I haven't figured out how to get downstairs yet, but. or something. Oops. Door shut pretty loud. Maybe that sounds a joke there is no downstairs. <laughs> Anyway, ooh, they got a bell. Let's go ring the bell. <clears throat> nice mulch path. Let's just ring it easy. That's a good bell. I barely touched it. Oh, look, there's a whole bunch of little cabins right there by the lake. And there is a downstairs. I can see the window. Oh, heck, I found the downstairs. Look at this. Wow. You don't know what this is. I'm sorry, but actually I'll tell you it's a telescope. It's a nice ass book. Nice telescope. Mm -mm. It's the clubhouse. Anyway, we gotta get out of here soon and get back to the trail. This game I used to have one of these. Let's see, do they have a marble? <sighs> no marble. That's a bummer. So I would play it if there was a marble. But, uh, there's a little thingy there. It's not working for me right this second with the camera in my hand. Here we go, Gorman Camps at Chairback Mountain, Appalachian Mountain Club. Whew. To get to that lodge, I thought uh, I was on a trail that went there. I was on some kind of trail, but uh, it just, I got lost a few times off of it. And I don't even know what the hell I was on. I was trying to get to a trail to end it. I thought they connected. it. But anyway, uh, we got into thick, thick um, pine trees and vines and all kinds of crap. And then I was walking through like bogs. Uh, it was crushing me. Uh, I finally made it down and got there, but it was not an easy task for 
Two and a half miles, maybe. All right. All right, we're down the trail a little bit. Um, it rained like crazy last night. My feet got <clears throat> pretty messed up. They're feeling okay now. A little sore and tender, but they got really pruned and uh, started getting a blister on my left heel and on my right pinky toe area. But everything's dried up now. Might be getting some rain here in a little bit. It's been hotter than crap. Not felt good this morning. Feeling better now, but uh, anyways, probably go to somewhere like Crawford Pond. There's supposed to be a beach there. Camp out, and then I'll get me close to White House Landing. This is pretty cool. This little area I'm in now. Um, been through a bunch of blowdown that's been cut up quite a bit there's one right there but it was really thick for a little while but anyway, I thought I'd share all right quick break at East Branch lean to skate the heat for a little bit do some hiking this evening and go from there not much of a view but a little bit Afternoon at the beach, Crawford Pond. You coming to hang out at the beach too? All right, we're just waiting this storm out. We're still here at Crawford Lake. You can see it. Pretty good one. Anyhow, hopefully it'll let up in a little while. Thunder will pet, lightning will pass. We'll get back on the trail. Try to go to Antlers. Um, not a big hurry to get there if it's going to be raining, so. And then tomorrow, White House Landing. So eventually, we'll get up and work our way towards that way. All right, there's Mount Katahdin in the clouds. So we had a view here. There was a view earlier, a couple of them supposedly, but we were in the clouds, so. All right, let me save my video. We're at uh, Rainbow Springs.